I met my friend Joe in 1990. We had both accepted jobs at a very well-regarded environmental consulting firm in Sacramento, California. Our first day of work was employee orientation and Joe and I hit it off right away. I looked forward to getting to know him better, but little did I know after first day of work, he took off for a month to Costa Rica. I guess he had better employee negotiating skills than I did because I was right back at work on day two. Joe and I had similar interests and before long we were out exploring the great outdoors and really enjoying each other's company too. We had a good time exploring and adventuring and often went with other friends. Joe came back from lunch one day and told me he had met a woman named Margie who he asked out on a date. They became steady partners and after some time, they got married on Margie's family ranch in Redding. Margie became one of my adventure buddies too and we enjoyed each other's company and the company of other friends on many trips. Joe and Margie have very positive attitudes so even when things aren't going right out in the wilds, we still had a good time and find times to goof off and just have fun. Over the years, Joe and I had talked about moving to Southern Oregon and either expanding our consulting business or just moving there after we retired. I retired in 2016 and moved to Southern Oregon. Joe and Margie had been living for the last 15 years in Salt Lake City, Utah. This fall, Joe and Margie sold their house in Salt Lake City, said a sad goodbye to friends, and moved to Southern Oregon to become my neighbors. In celebration of their move, I invited Joe and Margie and my friend Claudia to go hike Joe's Rock in the Siskiyou National Monument. And Joe had to remind me that, of course, Joe's Rock. Joe's Rock is at an elevation of 4,590 feet. There's not a trail there, but it's an easy hike going down a dirt road and then just scrambling up the side of the hill. It was a beautiful cold fall day. The skies had cleared somewhat from the previous day's rain and we were going to get some awesome views down the valley and towards Mount Ashland. Even though the area is only a few miles from Ashland, Oregon, it's not well known and the roads aren't well marked and there's no trailhead to speak of, so we had the whole area to ourselves. Joe's Rock is a volcanic outcropping with sparse vegetation on the top, but affords a 360 degree view of the Rogue River Valley and over into California. This area is my playground where I hike, I ride my motorcycle, I camp and I fish and explore and ski and just really have a good time only a few miles from my house. I was glad that Joe and Margie moved to Southern Oregon and I look forward to more adventures with them to explore the area in this beautiful region. There's Joe on top of Joe's Rock. Good eye. Joe's Rock.